loss of life. And we are talking about a case where the parties involved are so anxious. On one hand, and I can now tell you, speaking from where I am as a judge of the High Court and currently dealing with murder trials, this is the situation that we as judicial officers find ourselves in. And let's just have a discussion on that. You will bring a person to court child the way the suspects in Wilkimani's case have been charged. And these persons are constantly reminding me as a judge that they need to be heard. And not just to be heard, to be given an opportunity to be heard. They will tell you that I need my lawyer, I need statements, I need, I'm live to that, I am ready to deal with those two demands or requests. But where do I come into the picture? In my considered opinion, a criminal justice system is a conveyor belt system. I am almost at the tail end. Take, for example, you are making a shoe. I might as well be just the last person who will put in the shoeless, just to make sure that when you walk, the shoe does not come out. But somebody else will have started with the sole, with the size, and all that. Now, when I find myself in court, and I'm speaking this because I want us to have a candid discussion.